Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Sure. Here is an example of a JavaScript pop-up alert. Explanation The alert, function is a built-in JavaScript function that displays a pop-up dialog box with the specified message. In this example, the message hello. This is a pop-up alert message will be displayed in the pop-up alert box when the code is executed. Here are some key points to keep in mind when using JavaScript pop-up alerts. Pop-up alerts can be used to display important messages or notifications to users on a web page. Pop-up alerts can be triggered by user interactions such as clicking a button or submitting a form, or they can be displayed when the web page is loaded. It is important to use pop-up alerts judiciously as they can interrupt the user experience and may be considered intrusive. You can try running this code in an HTML document by including it within a script tag in the head or body section of your HTML file. Here is an example of how you can include the code in an HTML document. When you open this HTML file in a web browser, the pop-up alert with the message hello. This is a pop-up alert message will be displayed. Feel free to modify the message in the alert function to display a custom message of your choice. In JavaScript, the alert method is used to display a pop-up alert box with a message. This is commonly used to provide information to the user or to prompt the user for a response. The alert box typically contains a message specified by the developer and an OK button for the user to dismiss the alert. Here is the syntax for using the alert method. In this syntax, the alert keyword is the method being called to display the pop-up alert box. The message you want to display to the user is enclosed in parentheses and double quotes. Below is an example demonstrating the use of the alert method. When you run the above code, you will see pop-up alert boxes with the messages specified in the alert method calls. Remember that the alert method is commonly used for simple notification purposes. For more complex interactions or user inputs, you may want to explore other methods like confirm or prompt. I hope this tutorial helps you understand how to use the alert method in JavaScript. Let me know if you have any questions or need further clarification.